What's up, everybody? It's your boy T. Jones of John Street TV. Go subscribe to me right now. Pause the video. Go subscribe to me, John Street TV. All your um entertainment news. But yo, this is Best in the World 1989. Shout out to my boy War Machine. Um, yo, let's get back into this WWE ROH TNA news that's going on. It's not even a. I mean. It's not even like a rumor anymore. Like everybody's talking about it. You know, the Q's talking about it. The Silent Monsters talking about it. Don Tony's talking about it. Uh, and the Forbes is talking about it. Uh, Wrestling Inc. is talking about it. Rings. Everybody's talking about it. So it's a big thing right now. So, like I said in the last video I posted on here, what does it mean if WWE buys TNA? Like I said before, the they're trying to, if they buy them, they're buying the video just for the video library. They're shutting where it is that they get it. They're getting the video library and shutting TNA down. Now, in the past, War Machine pointed out, like, yo, Jones, you look like you hating. You look like a hypocrite. Like, you say you want TNA to win, but you're trying to, but it looks like you're trying to, look like you want to fall too. It's not that I want TNA to fall. Let me recap my statements. I used to like TNA. I feel like Final Deletion is something they're hanging on to. That's the thing that's keeping them alive. Now, if WWE does get TNA, they're getting it for the library. Could That's the only reason they would get it and they would shut it down. I mean, I mean, like, what would ROH do if they got TNA? I mean, in the I forget the, the, the company that's trying to get them. The same people that run ROH they want, I think the station that runs ROH would, would try to get TNA, but what would that mean? Like, could that help ROH? You know, because right now, ROH is in limbo. Like, ROH is, you know, I, you really don't hear people talking about ROH. Like, compared to ROH to TNA, TNA is, like, more talked about compared to ROH. You know what I'm saying? I, like, realistically, I only hear about ROH when I go to their website and when they post them on their YouTube channel. But that's neither here nor there. But in a way, if WWE did, I think, I want to say T, WWE will get the TNA video library because, like I said, they got AJ Styles. They can do the best of AJ Styles on the WWE Network. They got Bobby Roode now. Best of Bible, Samoa Joe, Best of Samoa Joe, Austin Aries, the, the uh, guy that's in the, who's the cruiserweight champion. He was the, he was suicide. So they got uh, Eric Young, Sting. I mean, they could do all kinds of matches from you know put all that on the network. You know, what I mean, that's the most logical thing they can do. I mean, Billy Corgan. Yeah, I mean, he's not even a full owner. He doesn't have full ownership. He's a share owner, from what I hear. You know, so he doesn't have full ownership. Dixie Carter still has her hand in there. Corgan has his hand in there. But um, I want to say WWE might be able to get it for the video library. I mean, it would make sense. It would make a lot. It would make a lot of sense for them to do that. But um, yeah, man. In the comments, let me know how y'all feel about it. What are, you, what are your thoughts? Um, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you don't like it, thumbs down. I mean, hey, if you if you're in the middle, don't even if you're in the middle, leave a comment. You know what I'm saying so. I'm out. Peace.